Hey, Don, good evening. I am here at UD's Kennedy Union, where a very special event is taking place. This is an event that turns one of the most prestigious universities in the country into one of the funnest. Temporary tattoos, bowling, and balloons. That, that's all pretty cool, but there is one thing that young Malcolm Maddox holds in much higher regard. I get to see my sister and I get to spend the weekend at UD. And he's not alone. As a matter of fact, as many as 400 kid brothers and sisters will be spending the weekend at UD experiencing the allure of university life firsthand. The best part is to see the little sibs and the joy. They're really excited to learn about the campus and to spend time with their big sib because they don't always get to see them. UD's little sibs program has been going strong for decades and it's not just about fun. A seed is being planted and the weekend will leave quite an impression with those lucky enough to be here. It actually influenced me to come here, which is really nice. So everyone here is so friendly and so nice, and the environment is so welcoming. That's why I decided to come here. Lindsay Carmody would know she's been on both ends of the spectrum. She's been a little sib, and she's entertained her own younger siblings in previous years. She says even though the weekends are just packed with activities like foosball and even a hypnotist, the best part is being able to spend time with your family. Hanging out with my little brother Malcolm and enjoying his presence because I don't get to see him very often. So you see, Don, this really is fun for the entire family. The siblings, they get to reunite, and if they're lucky, if we're lucky, mom and dad get to spend a quiet weekend at home alone. From the University of Dayton, Malcolm Maddox for Dayton's News Source.